let us face it ai is ubiquitous models are everywhere and it is just the beginning in a short period of time they have created a huge disruption in every field slowly ai or ai agents are virtually occupying spaces workspaces it is essential for everyone to understand what is the power behind it hello all my name is balwant and i welcome you to my channel binary heart it is h e a r t h that's right this is my first video in understanding llm series in this video let us understand what is large language model or llm is this video is for everyone who is interested in ai or not interested in ai but affected by ai knowingly or unknowingly positively let's understand it beyond ai what i mean is the word artificial intelligence we all are observing incredible advancements in the field of natural language processing one of the most transformative development has been the rise of large language models oh wait what is nlp nlp gives computers the ability to read understand interpret and generate human language both text and speech nlp is nothing new it has been there for decades but has not created as much of disruption as llms have created llms you have likely encountered them in various forms from helpful chatbots to sophisticated writing assistants getting your query answered instead of googling it or maybe you might have generated fascinating ghibli haven't you tried that and yes have you noticed one such agent is there in your whatsapp also check your whatsapp you will see a round shaped disk probably in a violet blue color just press it and see now you can chat with your ai but what exactly are these digital behemoths and how do they work their magic let's break it down in a way that is easy to understand let's put it on our learning map a user using prompt app for example chat gpt gemini or ai assistant in browser for different purposes user utilizes it for writing stories writing codes getting summary from documents converting photos into anime photos using it for translation and for various other purposes but we have a question how does llm do all these things how can a single program achieve everything let's understand llms are artificial intelligence models designed to understand and generate human like text imagine a student who has read almost entire internet books article websites codes and has learned to identify patterns and relationship between words i am using this patterns and relationships between words as a narrow personal trait actually every individual is different and how they learn and remember things may have 100 different variations i am not an expert on that but just for simplicity consider that the brilliant student has learned to identify patterns and relationship between words how a word in a given sentence 
is related to another word and what pattern it fits into you may call it an individual technique for acquiring knowledge and answering any query using pattern and word relationship well you may not agree that it works for humans but it does work for machines that is the important point llms are similar but on a vastly large scale they are trained on a massive data set of text and code enabling them to perform a wide range of language based tasks llm perform tasks like generating text writing articles emails poems codes and many more things answering questions providing information based on the, their vast knowledge summarizing text condensing long documents into short versions engaging in conversation powering chatbots virtual assistants translating languages converting text from one language to another think of models like gpt3 chat gpt google's gemini and llama by meta these are all examples of llms that have captivated the public imagination with their impressive capabilities let's take a pause and quickly check our learning map we had a question about what llm is and how it acquired vast knowledge answer to the first part of the question is it is an algorithm or in a simple language a program called a neural network it is trained on a large data set how to generate human like text how to perform language task and it is all done on a large scale it required terabytes of data or petabytes of information and to process it racks of servers machines gpus tpus now let us understand how llm works it has got its training and how it works now the magic behind llms lies in a technique called deep learning and a specific type of neural network architecture known as the transformer let me simplify important parts of llm creation first one is massive data training llms are fed enormous amount of text and code on varied subjects during this training they learn the statistical relationships between words as our brilliant student had learnt it same way for instance they learn that the word peanut is often followed by butter or allergy peanut butter peanut allergy they learn to convey meaning effectively by recognizing and predicting language patterns which includes how words and phrases typically co-occur and how sentences are structured well does that remind you your high school grammar well the llms are more or less follows the same process second one is neural network these are complex network of interconnected nodes like neurons in the brain that process information note that the transformer architecture is particularly good at understanding context and relationships between words even when they are far apart in a sentence next llms use prediction when you give an llm a prompt for example write a story about rabbit and tortoise it uses its internal pattern to predict the most likely next word in the sequence it then continues this process word by word to generate a coherent and relevant response it chooses words and phrases that it anticipates 
most and will be in accordance with the input which you have given i mean the prompt which you have given well just on a lighter note and just to experience it why don't you try asking your favorite ai assistant to write a short story about rabbit and tortoise check what reply you get okay now the next llm uses is attention mechanism and this is the game changer a key innovation in the transformer architecture is attention mechanism this allows the model to focus on the most important words in the input when making predictions similar to how we human pay attention to attention to certain parts of a sentence to understand its meaning for example dancer set the dance floor on fire you get the meaning that the dancer danced extremely well however if you focus only on the floor on the fire or even dance floor on the fire it will give a completely different meaning if you identify important words then only you will get the meanings right and that is what llms focus on using all these techniques llms are created essentially llms do not understand language in a human sense language for us is not just words and sentences we develop emotions and senses around it that is not the case with llm instead they are incredibly sophisticated pattern matching machines that can generate text that often appears remarkably intelligent let us get back to our learning map it has progress now it has got training techniques as you can see transformer architecture word relations context of the discussion pattern matching and identification and very importantly attention mechanism all these terms listed for llms are basic and highly important part of artificial intelligence you can explore these terms more to start your ai journey or learning ai it is important to understand what neurons are in the neural network which is a backbone of artificial intelligence a neuron in a neural network is the most basic computational unit that processes and transmits information it takes multiple inputs applies weights to each input sum them up and passes the result through an activation function to produce an output in a simple language your input will get a certain numerical value assigned to it and it is processed several times through activation function to perfect it in such a way that it will be capable of giving perfect and expected output think of a neuron deciding if an email is spam it might takes inputs like uh, the number of uh, spelling mistakes the presence of words like uh, lottery or free whether the sender is in your contacts each input is assigned a weight that is important the neurons sums these weights and if the total exceeds a certain threshold the activation function fires producing an output that signals this is likely spam note it is just a prediction in this video we have seen what llms are and how they are trained on various uh, subjects using terabytes of data and what techniques they use during the training the capability of llm is its knowledge retention 
in terms of mathematical model called a neural network thank you for watching this video in my next video on llm i will talk about important concepts categories and architecture of llms press the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you